Sugar Girl Tiffany, Madam Lizard's Black Beauty Hair Palette Psychic Pisces High Priestess, aka the light that shines like a diamond. Also known as your modern thing nun, one whom isn't within a coven, a convent, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching on tonight. If you would be so kind to please like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. So please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not. So remember that this reading may apply to your past, your present, or your future. As well as it may be pertaining to you or any and everyone in between that you may or may not know. With that being said, guys, we're going to get started. I do hope you all are doing well and feeling well on tonight. So, uh... Let's see what's going on with you all. So we have the magician here. Someone could definitely be into divination. Someone could be uh, into manifestation or trying to manifest something to go in their favor. Um, somebody's manifesting a change. Some type of change. Somebody... Um, is desiring some type of fulfillment, um, empowerment, okay? And so somebody is trying to manifest this, okay? Um, yeah, they could be using some type of dark, sinister, evil, wicked, demonic type of practices to do so with the devil being here. Somebody is toxic. Somebody is full of temptations, desires, lusts, um, addictive patterns of behavior um the devil talks about a lot of different things from sinister evil wicked dark type of energy to lust temptations desires bad habits addictions addictive patterns of behavior and things like that here okay i feel like with this being coupled with the magician here somebody is into the dark art somebody is using black magic voodoo hoodoo hexes curses spells it could be sending someone to the evil eye um doing sensoria or something some type of uh dark practices dark magic practices here to bring about a change that they want yeah um this has to do with a judgment here okay um somebody is making some type of decision they could be trying to sway somebody's judgment or decision okay or this could just be the judgment that they have made the decisions that they have made here okay however what it what it is whatever someone is using magic to manipulate to change is causing some type of conflict here yeah it's causing uh some type of conflict and defeat here okay some type of judgment or decision um that someone has made has caused some type of conflict fighting fussing cussing arguments disagreements misunderstandings here okay yeah there could be three or more people there could be a group of people who have indulged you know with each other to do this okay there could be a three or more people who are fighting and arguing amongst themselves because of this judgment here this group of individuals um they're all chained to the devil their puppets the shepherds for the devil here they sold a soul to the devil okay in some way shape form or fashion here okay so they're a part they're doing these sinister evil wicked things together to try to um, manipulate you know they're using divination manifestation uh, spell work to change something to go in their favor what they like but they're in toxic dark demonic energy here okay yeah they're ver they're working very hard to do something here somebody is trying to invest um, somebody is trying to obtain so something has to do with money something has to do with money here I feel like they put forth a lot of hard work a lot of effort to obtain this money um invested a lot into th this this money here okay yeah we have the eight of swords here somebody could be feeling stuck restricted under you're unable to move or get out of a situation here okay um somebody could be in captive this the 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 eight of swords could talk about captivity imprisonment um They can talk about a lot of different things here. What they've put so much effort to work hard towards could lead somebody in jail or has landed someone in jail or it just has this group stuck here. Something has changed. Whatever they have done 
that bring about a change and has caused conflict and defeat for them. And someone could be feeling stuck behind because of this situation or could even be in jail because of this situation, okay? Or at risk of going to jail. Yeah, there's a lot of things that this group is doing. Something's been going on for quite a long time as well. For more than six years. Six weeks, six months, six years, something like that or what have you. We have the Seven of Swords here. So somebody, somebody is a liar, a cheater, a thief, a manipulator, a con artist, sneaking and creeping around, trying to get away with something here, okay? Yeah. There could have been all this, this effort. I told you, whatever they did, seems like they were, what they were investing in, what they were doing, what they were working towards, what they were putting a lot of hard work and effort towards, um, has to do with some type of financial stability and security. This may have landed somebody in jail because something was stolen. Yeah, yeah, six of coins here. Something has to do with a gift of generosity. There could have been a gift of abundance, like some type of gift of something that was left to someone else. Obviously, some type of tangible, physical, material uh, gift that was left to someone. Okay, this is what this these people have been working towards, trying to manipulate, trying to control, trying to take, trying to obtain in some type of way here. Okay, we got the Empress at the bottom of the deck. There could be a mother or a mother figure who's involved in this situation. Okay, yeah, Ten of Swords here. So there's definitely some type of betrayal, disloyalty, sabotage, ruin, endings, okay, um, as it relates to this situation here, okay? Yeah, this theft that took place amongst this group of individuals left somebody abandoned, neglected, and out in the cold here, okay? So they stole something from someone and they abandoned them. They neglected them. They, they left them in a position of, of having a lack of support or help or finances, money, resources, okay? I see earth signs here, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, water signs here, uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, fire signs here, Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo. There's several people that's involved in a situation, Spirit is saying. Okay, yeah, something has to do, they did this to an earth angel here. Someone who's very tempered, who's balanced, who's uh, innocent, who's pure, who's nurturing, who's kind, who's caring. Whatever this large amount of money was supposed to go to this person in this temperance energy here, but there's been some type of there's some type of sadness, loss, disappointment, and regret here. Okay, um, this person could have moved uh, away from these persons as well, moved on, moved away from these persons as well that was involved in this. Okay. There's a lot of magic that was done here, though. A lot of toxic negative energy. Here, guys, okay? So there's definitely some type of irreconcilable differences that's going on between this group of individuals that work together. Somebody is a drama queen. Somebody is thirsty. Somebody loves causing chaos as well here, Spirit is saying, okay? So we're clarifying this Eight of Cups, Five of Swords here. So something has to do with some type of settlement here, okay? Agreement, compromise here. Something to do with a settlement here. I also see the Divine Feminine and Children here. Something could have... Something could have that they saw that they took could have belonged to a Divine Feminine and a child here, okay? Spirit, clarify um, the Devil and the Three of Cups. So we got locked down here. These, this group of individuals who are in this toxic, demonic, devilish energy, they could be in mental conflict, stress, worry, depressed, dealing with anxiety, sleepless nights, okay? Um, they're either in some type of mental conflict or they're actually locked down. They could be confined in jail or in prison because of something that they've done here, okay? 
So you clarify seven of pentacles, six of pentacles, seven of pentacles, six of pentacles, please. Yeah, there's some type of irreconcilable differences between them. I keep seeing this. It's pertaining to this money. Sorry, what's going on? Somebody may have this money hidden in some type of lock box or something. Yeah. But there was a group of two or more people who were discussing, meetings took place with two or more people discussing and planning this money here, okay? Something could be going on in the present, in the now. I'm seeing today here, which talks about the present, the now, in the moment here. Somebody could be feeling stuck, restricted, unable to move. Somebody could have actually been arrested on today here due to some type of betrayal, disloyalty, sabotage, ruin. That is going on here. Yeah, these people are in denial about the fact that they stole something that was rightfully belonged to, obviously, a child and a divine feminine, okay? Uh, unless uh, that divine feminine is an adult, but it's something, a child of someone here. These people are in denial about the fact that they lied, that they cheated, that they stole, that they've been sneaking and creeping around trying to get away with this. They're not facing the truth. They're irrational in their reasoning, okay? They stole this from you. They stole this abundance from you, this gift of, uh, of, of donation or charity or abundance from you that was left to you. And they abandoned you, neglected you, and left you out in the cold. They left you with a lack of finances, money, and resources, okay? We got crushed. And they left you crushed, sad, broken, and feeling alone, okay? This is what these people did to you, okay? And they're in denial, okay? They're in denial about what they did or what went on. They could also be dealing with some type of disturbances, Spirit is saying. They've been doing some heavy spell work here. Yeah, overload here. Look, they did something in excessment to the point where they're overwhelmed by all of this shit that they have done here. Collaboration here. This is a whole scheme of team, a whole group of these people here. Um, three or more people who collaborated together for the purposes of money, okay, who stole... Um, something that rightfully belonged to someone else now they're dealing with conflict they're arguing they're quarreling they're fighting uh they're having disagreements there's misunderstandings that's going on here okay yeah so what else yeah this has to do with a family here so there's a family of individuals who have who are feeling overloaded. They've done something in excessment, okay, um, and they're overwhelmed. They're overwhelmed by what is going on here. They keep on doing magic as well, though. Okay, yeah, somebody could have been arrested. There's definitely some type of legal situation that's going on here with this group that collaborated together for the purposes of money, okay. Yeah, somebody's mad as hell. Somebody's furious, outraged, okay, or enraged, rather, pertaining to this situation, okay, pertaining to this conflict that is going on. I feel like somebody may be mad, may be angry that somebody was, uh, these people were arrested, okay, and have gone to jail because uh, obviously some type of truth or clarity must have came out about their involvement here. But we've got commitment here. These people were committed to doing what they were doing and working against you. And they were in denial about the truth of what they did here. Okay. This also says binding contract. These group they could belong to some type of secret society, clique, club, group, gang, uh, cult or coven or something like that where they are in some type of commitment where they've taken some type of oath okay so they're in some type of binding contract with one another here um or some type of binding contract uh has you know is at play here 
okay guys so that's what's going on here guys i do thank you all for listening and for watching if you'll be sure kind to please like share and subscribe it will be greatly greatly appreciated for those of you who would like to contact me you can do so at tiff.diamond.336 at gmail.com you can also follow me on instagram which is shine bright like a diamond 36 with the underscore between each word for any person who is interested in donating to the channel it is greatly appreciated i do thank you all in advance you can do so through cash app which is dollar sign tip diamond 36 or through paypal which is paypal.me slash at 36 diamond as always guys take care of yourselves take care of each other but most of all take care of your baby honey remember this is a wicked wicked world that we live in there's wickedness in high places and there's evil that's lurking around each and every corner even in a neighborhood near you so y'all watch your surroundings watch the company you keep watch surroundings in the company in which your children are in as well and considering the fact that you never know when someone may betray you backstab you try to hurt you or harm you honey keep you some protection on you y'all stay awake stay aware stay vigilant and stay prepared because if you stay ready you ain't got to get ready baby until the next time peace love and light namaste i am that i am created in the image of god yeah, guys, whoever this drama queen woman is that's thirsty, that's causing chaos, this person is feeling overloaded. They have done something in excessment. They felt like they were obligated to doing this, okay? Um, yeah, they they're, and now they're overwhelmed, okay? Because they have done, what they have done over and over and over again is some type of spell work on someone, okay? This person could be dealing with some paranormal activity, some disturbances, okay? These people have done a lot of different toxic, evil, wicked, sinister things to try to get things to go in their favor, to get things to go their way, okay? Um, And this was all for the love of money. This is all for the love of money. I feel like at the end of the day, these people um, didn't care what they had to do, okay? Lie, cheat, steal, kill, or anything else here, okay? But somebody is a straight-up drama queen. This person is a witch, okay? A, a witch practitioner, okay? This person uh, definitely practices the dark arts, okay? Very dark, sinister, evil, wicked, thirsty, and love-causing chaos, okay? But they have gone overboard with doing something. And this group of individuals that partook in this situation has gotten caught up okay till the next time peace love and light namaste